Thanks for tuning in, my name is True Soldier, and today I'm going to be showing you how to put a hat on with a mask. That sounds pretty lame. It sounds pretty lame, but I assure you it is not. It is actually a rare clothing glitch that will open up a world of new customization options for your GTA Online character. Okay. This is a very easy glitch, however it is all about timing. You should have no trouble hitting this clothing glitch successfully if you follow exactly what I say. The first step is to go purchase a hat and a mask that you'd like to wear with your outfit. I feel like this is a given, but I fear that if I don't say go buy the stuff, that will be the day that someone says, um, I'm having trouble with this glitch because no one told me I had to go buy a hat and a mask. I assume everybody knows this, but I'll leave this step in there for the one in a billion person that needs to hear it. You're definitely going to want to try a bunch of different combinations once you learn how to do this, but I suggest only getting what you need first. Just make sure that you can get the timing down before you go blowing a couple hundred grand on hats and masks. Okay, now on to the glitch. Head to your wardrobe and put on the outfit that you'd like to wear along with the mask that you've chosen. Don't worry about the hat just yet, we will get to that later. Now save this outfit. It is very important you do this before you run off in excitement eager to get down to business. I only say that because I'm speaking from experience. Sometimes I get a little ahead of myself. Now get to a vehicle and stand next to the driver's door. Pull up your interaction menu and select style. If for some reason you're not wearing the masked outfit that you just saved, make sure you currently have it equipped. Now select accessories, then go down to hats and put on whichever hat you wish to wear with the mask. The mask will disappear for the time being, but we will bring that back in the next step. Now, back out from accessories and hover over the word parachute. Don't click it, just hover. Don't click it, don't. Don't click it, just hover. This is where the timing is extremely crucial. While still hovering over the word parachute, press Y on Xbox or triangle on PS4 to get into the vehicle. As your character is getting into the car, Quickly scroll down and select your mask outfit before he closes the door. As soon as you equip the outfit, scroll back up to parachute, don't click it, just hover, and start spamming Y or triangle to get back out of the car. And when he gets out of the car, the hat will now spawn back on top of his head over top of the mask. Now, go save the outfit. Like I said, it's all about timing. If you didn't get it the first time, simply go back to accessories, select hat, and just repeat the steps. What I do to make sure that I get the timing right is I scroll down to the masked outfit as my character gets into the car. Once he is seated, he will start to reach for the door. Hit X on PS4 or A on Xbox to equip the outfit as he starts to reach but before he grabs it. And you should be successful every time. Also, the reason that we hover over the word parachute is because if you are hovering over the word outfit, it will not let you into the car. This glitch can be done pretty much anywhere that you have access to a vehicle. So you can do this right on the street and then run into any clothing store to save the outfit when you are done. You can also use this method to put on a helmet with any mask. However, once you have the helmet on over the mask, you have to hit the pause button, then find a new session, and when you spawn back in, then go save the outfit. If you try to save the outfit before finding a new session, for some reason the helmet won't stick. But this only applies when doing the glitch with a helmet. Hats can be saved right away with no issues. Finally, there is one hat that I just could not get to work, and that's the Red Baron looking flight cap. So don't waste your money or your time unless you truly want to give it a go and see if you have better luck than I did. With that being said, I want to thank everybody for watching. Be sure to click subscribe to stay up to date with all my gaming content. Hit that like button if you feel it in your hearts to do so. And last but not least, stay swole.